What is going on guys, they were pro 2 5 here and yesterday we got all the maps for the Descent DLC number 3 for Black Ops 3. I know there's a lot of 3's in there, just work with me here, alright guys. So, uh, all the maps are pretty cool, uh, there's 4 maps as always and then there comes the, the zombies which I made a video about yesterday so if you guys haven't seen that video I'll link it down in the description and uh, you guys can go check it out right now if you guys haven't seen it. So uh, yeah, it's full of fun stuff that, that, that DLC for zombies is probably one of the best ones so I encourage you guys to check it out. And let's just jump in right into these maps. So the first one it says Empire, and you guys can see here by the images, this is actually a really cool map, a fan favorite, and it's called Raid from Black Ops 2. But now they brought it back, and it's called freaking Empire, guys. This is so cool. So uh, the description of this map says Treyarch adapts its Black Ops 3 movement system to Call of Duty Black Ops 2 fan favorite map Raid. A reimagining of this classic medium-sized map features an authentic Roman villa that has been recreated by a modern day eccentric billionaire where a classic map structure mixes with the new gameplay mechanics of Black Ops 3. So all the movement is gonna go faster in the maps just like every other map in here you know the movement is gonna be medium sized maps and the movement is gonna be really really fast paced and that's what I like that's Call of Duty right. The second map of this DLC is called Cryogen and it's uh, located far off the coast of Dead Sea and an isolated compound holds some of the world's most dangerous criminals in frozen isolation. Sentry guns, sentry towers keep uh, watch over the small map circulars design as a frantic combat is funneled around the prison cryogenic tubes where opportunities for raw running attacks abound. So this reminds me of that one map in Black Ops 2 as well uh, in the middle where all these tubes were at. I'll show you a picture guys if I can find it but it's really cool how you can just war on and these things. I think you can do it. Um, I think it's gonna be a circular map, like it says, and you can be able to war on on these tubes where the prisoners are located. And maybe there's some kind of thing that triggers the sentry guns. I don't know. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, but the next map, the third map of this DLC, is, is called Berserk. Now, Berserk is an ancient sentinels from a lost civilization guard for the entrance to Berserk, a Viking village. Frozen in time, players will fight through blizzards and control the center bridge as they navigate these medium sized maps, wooden buildings, deadly rocky uh, outcroppings, and tight checkpoints. So, this is the frozen map, this is a snow map, and this is probably one of the freaking coolest maps I've seen. Look at that big ass statue back there. This is gonna be an insane map, and I think this, uh, this building, as you guys can see here, it's gonna be one of the main points of the map. Uh, so we're on the side of the mountain. You know what else can we do in this in this game? So the fourth and final map of this DLC is called Rumble. Gamers battle amongst the larger-than-life me mechanized mechanized warriors in Rumble, a stadium where giant robots battle to roar of the crowd. This medium-sized map funnels high-speed combat to the en to the entrance arena, central arena, where players battle their way through fallen max and pyrotechnic so all these maps are pretty cool guys I'm not gonna lie I like these maps and uh, I think they're gonna be fast paced this DLC I think it has that kind of a uh, feeling to it you know it's gonna be fast paced not like the other maps that I didn't like that much but that's about it guys that's all the four maps coming to this DLC on July 12th hope you guys are excited for that and uh, yeah that's been it guys like and subscribe if you're new to the channel and uh, comment below what you guys think about this and uh, yeah that's about it I'll see you guys on my next video